and welcome back to an all new newly made game. I'm Tink Farts Mills. We have our lovely cameraman, Fred. Hello, Fred. I'm Tink Farts I'm lovely. How are you, Fred? I'm doing good. That's good. We're going to ask our couples three five point questions, two ten point questions, and of course a twenty five point question. And whoever gets the most points, of course, walks away with the grand prize of a lovely trip somewhere. The other two couples <clears throat> will receive. A year's supply of steak, baked potato, and the grill and all the mi <clears throat> excuse me mixins to make them a nice meal every night for a year. It's in good hell. I'm gonna go ahead and send off our uh, ladies. You didn't introduce a couple's tank. Oh my god, what the hell's wrong with me? I'm sorry, let's go ahead and do our couple number one. It's Michael and Nicole. Hello. <gasps> we have Sir Mix a lot. And Tracy. Hey man, what's going on? Hi. We have Steven Tyler and Princess Pope. Hello! What the hell? I should not just scream and fucking sing. It gets on my damn nerves. Sorry! You're still doing it, motherfucker. Anyway, I'm Princess Pope. This is, and this is Screamy. I'm in the audience. Alright, let's go ahead and send our ladies back first, shall we? Or wait a minute. No, we're going to send our gentlemen back first. We'll be right back, folks. Yeah, we went ahead and sent the ladies back first. I don't know where my head is today, Fred. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, Michael. Name one dish you hate that, you're, that Nicole cooks. Huh? Uh, uh, uh. He said spaghetti and meatballs. What's wrong with it? Uh, uh, uh. He said the spaghetti's kind of dry. Then that's soft on it. All right, sir. Mix a lot. Let's yeah, see here. I don't think she really cooks that much, but she made me eggs once, and they were they were they were burnt to to hell, and the toast was so. I didn't say eggs and toast, I guess. Ooh, the Spice Festival, Fred. Oh. Steven. Let's see here! Steak! It's raw! Ew. Okay, thank you, Steven, for singing your answer. <laughs> <laughs> so, mix a lot. What was the first anniversary gift you bought for your for your lady? Let's see here. I know what I bought. I bought a damn 12 pack of fucking socks and underwear. Fucking bitch, wear them for damn a month. Fucking nothing. Gag my ass. You can't do that shit. You can't walk up here and then walk in the room. She takes the damn socks off and she be wearing for God know how long and the motherfucking stand up on the damn floor. It smells like shit. So I bought a whole big old bag of underwear and socks. I said, here, honey, here's your plenty to change every day. Okay, Steven. I bought her a diamond ring! Nice gift. Michael. <gasps> he said he bought her a, a box of chocolates and some flowers. Oh, that's nice. Steven, what is one thing that your spouse cannot do without? Ham and beer! Okay, Michael. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, pizza, he says. You can't do it without pizza and cheese. Oh, pizza and cheese, huh? So it makes a lot? Let's see here. She can't do it out. It's sick. She can't do it out there. That's a damn shit. All right, let's go ahead and take a break. We'll bring our ladies right back. All right, welcome back, ladies. We ask your husbands three five-point questions. Nicole, name one dish that Michael hates that you cook. 
he complains about everything. <gasps> but the one that he complained about was spaghetti and meatballs. Why did he complain about it? He said there wasn't enough sauce. <gasps> it was <gasps> saucy enough. I guess he wanted watery. I don't know. Oh, 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 oh! Don't argue with me, Michael! He said he wants enough sauce on a plate and scrub his... He can rub his cheesy bread in it and get a glob and eat it. Well, you should have told me. Oh, he said he did. Well, I don't. Sometimes I don't understand you. Uh, I will do it for you next time. Uh, Mwah. Uh, Tracy. Uh, I don't really like to cook. I burned his hot dog once. You burned my dick, bitch! Oh, I thought it was a hot dog. <laughs> you stupid. You just eggs and toast! Oh, yeah. I was drunk. You always drunk. Princess Poe. What? One thing I could. I'm a good kid. What in the world? Oh, I remember now. I gave him a raw steak and he pissed me the hell off. Look at his stuff fucking bimbo's ass when he's at the goddamn theater. She was hot! I'm your wife, damn it! I think a little bit of Apple came out on that one. Shut up, Tank. Tracy? What was the first anniversary gift that Sir mix -a bought you? Well, stupid underwear and socks. I don't need them. I have enough. Yeah, you need them every day. Princess Poke. He bought me a diamond. Damn thing so small. I think a fucking magnifying glass to see it. It was three carrots! Like I said, it was small! You're rich, hell! Three carrots? That's a sh- Bro, it's huge! Not for me! I just got my fucking knuckle. Nicole? What was the first anniversary gift that Michael bought for you? Flowers and chocolate. <gasps> And I give him donuts. <coughs> he said in chocolate meal. Yes. <laughs> Alright, Princess Poke. What is one thing that Steven said you can't do without? Hey, that's easy. Fucking pork and beer. Hell yeah. Michael? Nicole? What's one thing that Michael said you couldn't do without? Pizza and cheese. I knew he would say that. <laughs> he can't live without donuts. Tracy? This is easy. Sex. Alright. We're going to let the ladies go off and we'll be right back, folks. You mean the I meant men. Gosh damn it, Fred. I am not here today. I know. Anyway, the little, the, the little, the little gentleman almost said are off in the soundproof booth. <laughs> Michael's no fucking little guy, I tell you that. Alright, we're going to start with the co. This is two 10 point questions and a 25 point question. Uh, Nico, what is the strangest thing that you bought for Michael? The strangest thing I bought for Michael? Yeah. Um. Well, I, it wouldn't be strange to him. But I would consider it strange for anybody else. A giant knife. I'd say it's pretty fucking strange. Tracy? Let's see. I bought him suspenders. He hated them. I can't see Sir mix -lot wearing suspenders. <laughs> I liked him. Princess Poe? Hmm. <laughs> I bought him a blow up doll. May I ask why? I was pissed. I didn't want to fuck him. So I bought him a fucking blow up doll. I can fuck her when I'm mad. Okay. 
Tracy, how well would you say your spouse makes love? Is it over the moon, crazy and cozy, or lazy in a snooze fest? Oh, he's crazy and cozy. Princess Poe? He's lazy in a snooze fest. He's fucking 70 something years old. What? He's old! I ain't married him for his money. I see. Nicole, over the moon, crazy and cozy, or lazy and snooze fest? Over the moon. Well, that's very nice. Princess Polk, does your spouse listen to you when you talk? Hell no! I'll be sitting here talking. I'll look over there. He'll be fucking snoring on the damn couch. <laughs> He's old, you know. Yes, you said that. I know, but I'll change it again. He's old fucking man. Nicole, does your spouse listen to you when you talk? Sometimes, but, mo but he'll argue with me. Okay. You know how he is, Tink. I do. He's a spoiled brat. Just don't tell him that. That rhymed. <laughs> Tracy? Um, he does sometimes. But sometimes he doesn't. All right, we're going to bring the gentleman back. We'll be right back, folks. All right, welcome back, spouses, husbands, whatever you want to say. Michael? What is the strangest thing that Nicole ever bought for you? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh. What's so funny? <laughs> he said, well, <clears throat> maybe strange. Other people may not be strange to him. But it was a big old fucking knife. And you ever laughing at what he says. I don't have no words for you. No. Sir mix a lot. She bought me a fucking damn rainbow pair of fucking suspenders. I wear suspenders. I wear this kind of outfit. At least you got it right. Steven. Ben Gay! That's for all people, hell! I didn't say Ben Gay! Princess Polk? What? Your voice changed. Whoops! Anyway, you got it wrong, stupid! Make sure you give him five Viagra Press! Ha 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 ha! Sir lot. what do you think Tracy said? How well do you, do you make love to her? Over the moon, crazy and cozy, or lazy in a snooze fest? Yeah. I'm crazy and then cozy. Yeah, you are, baby. Steven? Over the moon! You ain't fucking over the... What the hell? You ain't over the moon! You're a snooze face, you motherfucker! You're 70 fucking 90 years old! 70, 90?! That's not a number! You're old! I just sleep! You can't... I have to tell you, Chuck, it's just ridiculous. I'll get him all... Well, I get him hot and bothered. Next thing I know, I'm climbing on top, he's like right fucking snowing his ass off, and the fucking doodles done went fucking limb and fell on the damn side of his damn leg. I don't need to know about that, but thank you, Princess Boat, for the very descriptive detail about your husband's wiener. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the truth? Oh my god. Nicole? How well does your, does, I mean, Michael, how well do you think Nicole thinks you make love? <gasps> hey, shit, I were the main. You got it right, Michael. <sighs> and Steven. Do you listen to your spouse when you talk, when she talks to you? No, I'm tired. I'm usually asleep. Yes, you are stupid. I'm a snoring. 
I'm trying to tell you about my fucking day. It's boring! You motherfucker! Michael. You think Nicole thinks you listen to her? <sighs> he says jam time when she has something really interesting to say. Basically, it's about fucking donuts or cookies, and he really wants to listen. You should want to listen anyway, Michael. What kind of husband are you? Uh -huh. He said he finds you very interesting. Uh, I'll, never mind. I'll disregard what I was about to say. Mm hmm. Sir Mix a Lot? Eh. I do listen sometimes. But sometimes she talk about some crazy shit that so I don't really care about it. Alright, we're gonna tally our scores. We'll be right back, folks. Alright. Steven and Princess got 40 points. It sucks! I think good. Tracy and Sir mix a lot have 55. It's cool, hell yeah, it's good. Our winners, of course, are Nicole and Michael with 60 points. <sighs> Yay! Yeah, we're going to throw in some, four, uh, some free donuts and stuff for y'all, if you don't mind. And maybe some chocolate. Okay. <sighs> Stay tuned next week, folks, for an all new newlywed. Can you give him chocolate milk, too? He really wants it. No problem. There you go, Michael. Anyway, stay tuned next week, folks, for an all new newlywed game. I'm Team Farts. Have a lovely weekend.